One of my favorite things about experimental biology is that it's a great opportunity to meet and talk with some of the leading nutrition scientists in the world. And one of the questions that I had for these researchers is, who's your favorite scientist? It's J.P. Flatt, and Dr. Flatt was really a pioneer in understanding uh, energy balance, how the different types of food, fat, and carbohydrate, and physical activity interacted to affect body weight. I think his work is some of the uh, most impressive work in our field. Dr. Atwater, absolutely. He's always been my famous, you know, my favorite scientist. I teach advanced human nutrition. I use all of his stuff, so I just find him an amazing person. My, my favorite scientist, uh, I, I sort of qualify that to say living scientist working in the field right now in and out of the area of nutrition would be John Ioannidis, um, just because I think he his work has really been valuable, I think, in shining a light on uh, nutrition, uh, the state of nutrition evidence um, and the confidence we can have in our conclusions and in particular the fidelity and integrity in the reporting of the data. Um, uh, so he's my first choice. My favorite scientist is Alan Walker. He's a distinguished professor of nutrition who is an absolutely great mentor for me and helped facilitate my career instead of his career. My favorite scientist is Jack Monod. He's a French biologist who won the Nobel Prize in the 60s. He's the discoverer of the operon, the, the first sequence in DNA that relates to regulation of DNA expression. And that was an incredible discovery, but the reason why he's favorite is because he wrote about philosophy without being a philosopher. And uh, he has a book that summarizes many of his views called uh, Hazard et Necessité in French means chance and need.